How do I learn HTML? It's a question that I asked myself when I was starting out in web development. And it's a question that I get asked a lot on, especially on Twitter and other forums and even in the comments. And how do I learn HTML isn't just a question that some people might ask. It's a question that we all start off with when we're learning web development. And hopefully I should be able to give you some answers to that and point you in the right direction so that if you're planning to learn HTML and web development in general, then this video will help you out. Now, HTML is the building blocks of what websites are built on. It's the building blocks of what applications are even built on. And it's the building blocks of where you'll move to if you want to do front end design or become a web developer in general. It is the code that we use when we create websites. And HTML in general isn't that hard to learn. There's only so many tags you utilize. It's sort of like learning a language, whether that's English or Japanese or Chinese. And what you do is you learn the fundamental vowels and nouns and stuff like that. And once you understand how that structure works, you'll be able to use it in any method. When I was learning HTML, what I did was I started working on different projects and went through different types of tutorials and courses to be able to understand those concepts. I never actually bought any books or anything like that, but over time, I found that as long as I kept using that in practice, it sort of stuck in my head. Because if you don't actually start working on a project, you might not actually be applying those skills and essentially learning it properly. Now, if you want to learn HTML, what I would recommend is jumping onto a website called Free Code Camp. They're a website which provide lots of structure around learning how to become a web developer. And they don't just do HTML, they'll take you through everything, including CSS and JavaScript and everything on that journey. But the very first step in that journey is learning HTML. If you want to have a look at the website, I'll show you it right now. This is freecodecamp.org and they're not a website that just teaches you how to do HTML and courses in general. They also have really great news where they publish articles about the latest in development in general. So it's definitely worth checking them out. Now, what we're going to do is we're going to jump in and have a look what it's like using their system to learn HTML, because that's what we want to be able to do to start getting ready into web development. We can see that they're utilized by lots of large companies and they've been featured in lots of articles, but we want to grab the certificate here for a responsive web design. And we're just going to click to sign in. But when we do, we'll be going through the basics of HTML and HTML5. And what is that? Well, it's essentially learning how HTML works because HTML has a number of different aspects to it. It's got things like elements and tags and styles, and these are all filled out differently. So if we have a look at this course, we're going to go through all of these things on how to create elements, tags, how to create links and images and all of that good stuff. When we're done, we'll understand HTML and the next part to that is learning CSS, but that'll be for another video. So let's jump in here and have a look at the very first item. And this is the introduction to basic HTML and HTML5. So what is HTML? Well, HTML is hypertext markup language, and it's a language that essentially creates the structure for web pages. Now, this is just the introduction to this, and I'm not going to go through the whole thing. I might do separate videos for that, which I'll link up in the description maybe later. But for the time being, this should get you started so that if you want to learn web development, this is the place to go. The next place I would recommend to go to when you're learning HTML is w3schools.com. They're a website which really break down the building blocks of HTML, and they make it very easy to understand and learn. They've got a section here to learn HTML. And when you go through here, they show you the structure of what HTML should look like and describe to you how it works. And as you go through their system, they've got exercises where you can test yourself to see that if you're doing well or not. They've got quizzes as well, as well as references. And as you get further and further through their system and their website, then you'll be able to really test out your knowledge on HTML and build on it. So if you want to create links, images, tables, and all of that good stuff, you'll be able to go through their website and they'll describe every single aspect about that. So that's a definitely a good website to check out. And 
like the others, they have additional resources as well. So once you're done with HTML, you can move on to CSS or JavaScript and slowly you can build your web development skills in general, which is a great thing to be able to do.